Hi, this is Beverly Tomasian. I'd like to introduce you to the Pancreas Partner Teaching Tool. On this slide of the Pancreas Partner, we have a healthy pancreas. You can see there's a complete complement of beta cells. Now the job of the beta cells is to release insulin. This insulin is released when we eat food. The beta cells squirt out insulin to cover hyperglycemia that results from food intake. This is often referred to as bolus insulin release. In between the meals and through the night, the pancreas is also hard at work, squirting out a little bit of insulin to prevent hyperglycemia, and this is often referred to as basal insulin. But when the pancreas has type 2 diabetes, we have beta cell loss. If you turn the pancreas over to the other side, you can see what happens to the pancreas. On this particular side, there's less than 50% of the beta cells available to make insulin. And this is what happens with type 2 diabetes. There's a gradual loss of the beta cells of the pancreas, which means less insulin, which means when we eat food or in between meals, our pancreas is not able to keep up with the workload and release enough insulin to maintain euglycemia. This pancreas represents the natural history of type 2 diabetes, and I find it a very effective teaching tool when I'm working with patients and professionals to explain the pathophysiology of type 2 diabetes. This is Beverly Tomasian, signing off.